It's a good morning to Wes Davidson from Wes Davidson Real Estate. Wes, we've got some open homes again this weekend, a beautiful weekend to get out and have a look. But before we touch on those, Bridget Court, what's happened there? How is that beautiful house going? It's going very well, attracting a lot of interest. Um, it has not been sold. I've had a lot of people ask me, has it been sold and sold to a certain local? That is so far from the truth, it's not funny. Um, I think some people get two and two and come up with 35. Uh, so no, it is doing very well, tracking with the rec most inquiries we've ever had on or most hits on a house and views, that, and as you would expect. But no, it hasn't been sold yet, but um, I'm quietly confident we'll see a result fairly soon, just the same. I've heard those rumours too. Uh, open homes though, what have you got for us tomorrow? Uh, never ceases to amaze me. Um, by the way, the, the block in Bridget Court, they may be confusing with that, that has been sold, yeah. which is a totally separate <laughs> property. Um, so we've got some new properties, 26 McIntyre Street, Horsham. It's a three bedroom uh, brick veneer home, been very well built, had the one owner in there for the last 20 odd years. Um, it's on the market at 549,500, showing its age, but it's still a very good design, very practical, close to the Horsham West School, of course. Uh, big backyard, beautiful garden in the backyard, double garage, pergola, two living areas, and it's our classic 1990s sort of home. We also have a unit at 410 Glead Street, good one for the rental investors, on the market at 375,000. It's only a stone's throw, if you're a good throw, from uh, Coles. And it's in a complex of four. So it's a fantastic spot in between there and the bowling green. You find that Glead Street's always popular. It was rented for $300 a week previously, uh, but it's been renovated and ready for the owner occupier perhaps this time or for the rental investment. It should be fully compliant. Um, one Anderson Street. This is a surprise package. This house has been completely gutted. I saw it when it literally had no walls left. It was completely gutted. They started the game. And it's come up a treat. It is three bedroom, two bathroom, 429,500. Don't uh, let the location fool you. Go and have a look at this house. This house is absolutely stunning and a very good job by the owners. Three Acacia Street, Horsham is on the market at 359,000. Yeah, it's 684 square metres. It's quite, uh, quite a spacious home with extra living room at the back. It has three bedrooms, two of which have built in robes. Um, and when you go down the back, good size rear yard and a good shed. It's got evaporative cooling and gas heating, so central location, good one for the first home buyers, 359,000. I think that will attract quite a bit of interest. Um, but if you're thinking of selling a block of land at the moment, and that's probably the, the key, um, Bridget Court, uh, that block of land there, that attracted quite a lot of interest really quickly. People wanted to buy. That's the sort of rush that's on the market with land at the moment. So if you're thinking of selling, be it a house or be it a block, give us a call, 538 000 because they are still selling very, very well. Um, and the, the tax office, uh, the state revenue office is loving real estate because we're giving about 10% of the state budget in stamp duty. God damn them. Anyway, Wes, you have a wonderful weekend. For more details on those open homes, wdre.com.au. I'll catch you next week. Thanks, Sam. See ya.